Off-Broadway show on the Constitution has been extended until right before Election Day. Mike Sachs spoke to the writer and star about the show's timely message. Tell me what we're seeing here all around us. Yes. This is a recreation of the American Legion Hall in Wenatchee, Washington, which is where I'm from. And it's where writer and actress Heidi Schreck sets her play, What the Constitution Means to Me, revisiting her adolescent idealism about our country's founding document. Time begins now. The Constitution is a living document. That is what is so beautiful about it. It is a living, warm-blooded, steamy document. Lines like that help Shrek pay her way through college with money she earned debating in Legion halls across the country. But throughout the play, Shrek's adult self keeps butting in, like when it complicated her celebration of a landmark reproductive rights case decided by nine male Supreme Court justices in 1965. I actually found out while researching this that William O. Douglas, who was 67 years old, was actually having an affair with a 22-year-old college student. And, and it turns out that three other judges were having sex with young women as well. So I you know, I'm guessing that they, they, they really wanted to, to find a way to get the birth control flowing. <laughs> the last through the 90-minute play balanced the tears that come from Shrek's recounting the Constitution's broken promise of equal protection for the women in her family who endured generations of domestic violence. I learned a great deal more when I started looking into the Constitution as it relates to domestic violence laws, to abortion, to reproduction, um, to women's rights in the workplace. I... In trying to connect that to my family, I learned a lot about the women in my family, and some of it was heartbreaking. And so the show closes with another debate, this time against real New York City high school girls Thursday Williams and Roselli Ciprian over whether to abolish the Constitution. Thomas Jefferson himself said that we should write a new Constitution for every generation. We should not be living by the laws of dead people. My opponent quote who said that Thomas Jefferson said that the dead should not come for the living. But Thomas Jefferson is dead, so why is she listening to him? When I asked Rose Deli what the Constitution means to her, the 14-year-old debate champ pointed to the First Amendment. We could actually speak about issues that are actually going on in the world, and it feels like I actually can change America just by debate. Now, at the end of every show, a member of the audience picks who wins that last debate. As of this past Monday, Roselli and her 17-year-old counterpart Thursday Williams' record against Heidi was 32 to 7. What the Constitution means to me is playing at the New York Theater Workshop in the East Village until November 4th. Steve, Derry, we're going to check that out. That was fantastic. Yeah, great play. Good. You guys got to go Thank see it. Thank you for bringing that to us. Very nice.